ball screens, and VCU going to trap every single crossing action tonight from LSU. Trandon Watford, top recruit for LSU. Look how this VCU pressure defense has evolved since Shaka's days as the head coach. Trandon Watford, the floater, mm. freshman's got a pair. Them in scoring, so versatile. Another VCU turnover, chance to run for LSU. And it's Skylar Mays who converts, coming off an 18-point performance against Bowling Green. 30% from three. One of the worst three-point shooting teams in the country. Here's Evans from three. Couldn't hit. And Mays gets another board. James Bishop on the floor, forces it up and gets it to go. Against Bowling Green, he really loves Bishop and really his scoring potential. So able to bring Bishop in and sit smart for a moment in the paint. And they won't trap a whole lot in the full court. They just want to pick up, get into the basketball, and wear on you as the game moves forward. Three ball from Darius Days. He was here. And so it was not going to be easy for Will Wade. The departure was never going to be easy. Curry gets fouled on his way in. If he shot Curry, Curry will go to the free throw line. Double A investigation in his suspension at the end of last season with the release of transcripts from the FBI wiretaps. And that's why you see the FBI costumes as Vince Williams is able to convert. Good at it, but they have become very solid in the half court. So if you beat their pressure, you still have to execute and not turn it over against their half court defense. Williams off the window. This is a game that will stand out as a data point. And in that regard, it's big for both conferences, both the SEC and the A-10. Crowfield for three. And now LSU will show some pressure. Mays got his hand on it. Took it away. And follow is good from Charles Manning Jr. Presses. And so they press every day in practice. When they see pressure for the first time in a game, they turn it over immediately. How is that possible? No, it's a great point. Play for Tom Crean at Indiana. Alongside Victor Oladipo, that had, had some talent back in nice. at Wilmington. Nice touch inside. Extra pass, Santos Silva. Tom, against this pressure from VCU, you've got to keep the ball off the sideline. Two years at Randolph Macon, then he was the head coach there for 10 years. Division three, Randolph Macon. Play D3 ball, Lebanon Valley in Pennsylvania. And one coming on the LSU side. He went to the Sweet 16. He's got a serious approach to what he does. What a talented player and a competitor he is. Jenkins from 12. Of the nine SEC road wins last year, five of them came in overtime. Goodness. Emmett Williams extends for the jam. Where He's going before between the two. Probably same temperature today. So he's playing in a G League in a city that I don't even know which I state it's in. <laughs> Seth Greenberg's back in the studio. He's never looked at a map in his life. Jenkins able to slip it inside, then back out. Isaac Van for three. Who does this pace favor? And I think the, the slower it becomes, it... Taken away, Vince Williams slams it home, and VCU has a five-point lead. Wow, nice jump stop. Shot clock at single digits. Circus shot goes! Silva finds it. VCU up six, looking to add to it as the first half nears its end. That'll add. Isaac Van for three. Another turnover. Ripped him from behind. Van to the wing. Evans for three. You get out of character. Look at this pass. Nice save. Jenkins gives it right back. And Williams hits a triple. An LSU answer from freshman Trenton Watford. Rams. And Santos Silva sticks with it. Before he put it in. Shot clock off. Right? 
Thank you. I, that's that's was. If you were looking for a football tie into this one, LSU, the good news is as Dave could you not good. Well, I thought maybe the LSU fans were looking for something positive at this point. Sims late. And the difference between when he was a Division Three coach, he said, listen, in this system, I can play a lot of guys. You might only play 10 minutes, but you're still going to show up happy. Pardon me, six. Mays, great body control. Quick three in the other way. Santos Silva offensive board. LSU pushes. Bishop off the window. Track meet. VCU on the other side. Got it! Dariante Jenkins. Jenkins has impacted this game. And Mays blindly trying to save it. Putback goes. Not really an issue for VCU. A half step and a foul, and they'll count it. Miss picked up and put back in by Days. Mays got down the lane and put it off the glass. It's a game, it's a mature game. And in a game like this, the guy who can sort of can't be sped up is going to have success. Here's Javante Smart for three. With him taking it and missing it. And a missed opportunity for LSU. VCU the other way. Watford inside. I'm fine with it. I like I'd rather do it with a guard. And this is why you you know these times of the year, because that's Evans drains it. Also leave Darius Days on the floor with three personal fouls. Mays nice. with the dish and Williams with the flush. Lean. LSU hasn't led since the 11 minute mark of the first half. Jenkins with the feed. Silva with the finish. Overs in the last three minutes. And VCU's come back down to earth from the three point line in this second half. The ball was tipped, I believe, and still went in. Here's Javante Smart. Got it. That's tied up. Santos Silva spins in, slides through. We're going to have to play. Wow. Marcos Santos Silva. May spins, hangs, wow. hits. He had 21 and 18 against St. Francis. And now he's done it against a ranked LSU team. But I mean, VCU was in the double bonus. Yeah. Smart knocks them both down. He's got 20. Smart almost gave it up. Manning into the front court. Ooh. And they'll count it. Charles Manning Jr. with the bucket at one. Conference play. Three-point play for Manning. Get it. Santos Silva inside. And he has a rejected. An LSU opportunity. And a finish by Skyler Mays. Van goes one of two. And he does just that. Who does VCU want to go to? Mm -hmm. Well, lo looks like here, I mean, they're going to go to their ball screen stuff. That's not the shot you want. And it's a foul on the three. Inexcusable for LSU. It's off the floor. Dariante Jenkins is the guy. They go to the ball screen. And you try to challenge VCU's best perimeter shooter.
this season. He's going to play it out with Mays off the mark. Gets his miss back. No whistle. Loose ball. Possession error belongs to LSU with 10 seconds left. Gets involved. You can still switch that one. Mays will drive with seven. Pull up. Too strong. VCU has it and a foul. It was Marcus Santos Silva again. It's going to be in probably Skyler Mays' hands. One out of two. Five seconds remain. Here's Skyler Mays. Past midcourt. Through the would-be trap. Lost it. And with two tenths of a second left, this one's over. And VCU takes down Will Wade and LSU. 84-82.